Good morning, y'all. It's the last baking day before Christmas. Uh, I've got pies and cupcakes I'm making today. And uh, I think I'm going to get my husband to help me make some Buckeyes. So that's the, um, that's the baking for today. Lots of desserts. Tomorrow we'll be putting the, um, the final touches and putting the lasagna in the oven because that's what our traditional Christmas is, is lasagna. Anyhow, um, I've got a pie shell baking in the oven right now. I've got another one prepared right here that I'm going to leave unbaked. I'm making two different pies this morning, but um, the first one I'm going to make is a, um, with the unbaked shell. It's the pecan cheesecake pie. So it's like cheesecake on the bottom and then pecan pie on the top. So I've heard it's delicious. I have not tried it yet, but for rave reviews, so I wanted to try it myself, and I'm gonna get started with that in just one second. Let me get all my ingredients together. Okay, I'm back. I've got one um, eight ounce package of cream cheese. Let me turn this down where you can see what else I'm gonna do. Now I'm going to add one egg one teaspoon of vanilla, and one fourth a cup of sugar. And then I'm just gonna mix all that together and then we'll put it in our pie shell. So this will be a little bit noisy, so I'm gonna stop uh, the video until I get it mixed. Okay, I've got that all mixed up. You can see I put it on in this pie shell. Now I'm going to top it with one cup of chopped pecans. Sprinkle it all over the top of this. And that sounds good already to me. Get them even. Now I'm going to mix up a fourth a cup of brown sugar in this bowl, it's a clear bowl. And then I'm gonna put a cup of the uh, corn syrup. This is that Cairo, and I know there's a cup in here because I'd already used half of it and it's 16 ounce. So I'm just gonna pour this in there. And then I'm going to mix in three eggs with this. So, I probably should have already cracked those eggs so you don't have to watch me crack them. So what I'll do, I'll just stop the video, get my eggs cracked, and then um, start mixing this up and let you see it, okay? Okay, I just finished mixing all that up and now I'm just gonna pour it right over pecans and I've got my oven preheated now to to 370 um, 425 I'm gonna put it in there for about 10 minutes then I'm gonna reduce it down to 375 and bake it for anywhere from 25 to 30 more minutes so let me get that in the oven and I'll get right back with you. Okay, y'all, I just took it out of the oven. Look how this thing's split and open. I mean, that looks like a lot of yummy goodness. So it says to let it cool and it's gonna take a while for this to cool. And then, um, and then slice and enjoy. So hopefully we'll be able to enjoy it tomorrow and hopefully I'll be able to resist it between now and tomorrow. So, but Probably not. I'll probably wind up uh, uh, taking a, a slice tonight. And if I do, I will uh, add it to this video. So, y'all have a wonderful evening, and I will talk to you later.